KO Fantasy Boxing here. This is Alex Pierpaoli talking about Tremaine Midget Williams. Hey Tremaine, how you feeling? Feel good. How you doing? Good. You look good tonight. You uh, did some sparring with uh, with a big guy and a little guy. Yeah. What's that like? Um, it's kind of different because you got to change the style a little bit. But in the end, it's boxing. You got to take what they do good away and try to do what you do best. Now it looked really like you were uh, you were in there practicing some specific moves. Uh, what can you tell us what you were trying to do? Yeah, I was uh, I was training for Josh Balls. You know, I fight Josh Balls uh, in about two weeks. So he, it's the thing that he does very good. So I was trying to take what he does good away and try to work on things that I do well. All right, so you're fighting next Saturday night in uh, in Danbury, huh? Yeah, Danbury, my first fight in East Coast. My first fight in Connecticut as a pro, so I'm excited. How long, how long have this, has it been since you were in the ring? About 18 months. 18 months? Almost. Uh, I think it's a little more. <laughs> and how you feeling? You feel uh, you feel excited to get back? Yeah, actually I feel like I gained a step. Feel good, feel quicker, stronger, hey, smarter, down, faster. Over here. I'm ready. I got arrested uh, January 23rd at my grandmother's house. Um, then they shipped me to Whaley Avenue, New Haven Correction. Then they sent me to uh, Cheshire for about eight months I stayed out there and then the last four months I did it in a halfway house. So all together I did about a year away from home without my freedom. I got home uh, January 2015, uh, about the, I think the 22nd or 23rd and I've been home ever since. I was in the gym the next, well the day after the next, after I got home, I was in the gym and ever since I've been training. Looking forward to this fight that's coming up. So now you and uh, Brian, so you're not only a uh, trainer and fighter, you're roommates. Yeah. How's that going? <laughs> yeah. It's up and down. Yeah. It's like any friendship, any relationship. Because uh, it's more like you know, a friend, you know, it's kind of like a father figure in a way, a trainer, a mentor. So all those things combined with me growing up, I'm not the kid anymore. So sometimes I have a little, I don't know, we butt heads sometimes. Now you guys have known each other since you were nine? Yeah, 13 years. 13 years, wow. More than half my life, I'm only 22. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. That's pretty cool, yeah, I think a lot of people don't realize the uh, the bond that uh, a lot of trainers and fighters have between each other. Yeah, because it's time that we went cross country by ourselves, and it was just us against the whole tournament, well not the whole tournament, but us against everybody in a way. And no family for me, no nothing, but it's just me and my coach. And we riding out, we sticking it out, we toughing out, we actually coming home with the gold. Said blood, sweat, and tears, literally. Wow. Now what? Um, now you won a couple of national titles. Yeah, uh, the Ohio State Fair, the Augusta Summer Classic, the Pals, four silver gloves, two ringside, a uh, Golden Gloves, and uh, I believe something else. Four silver gloves. Yeah, back to back to back to back. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> 
Wow, you're like the Lakers. <laughs> yeah, I'm a Laker fan. Actually, I'm a Laker fan. Oh, you really? <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> Showtime. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And my favorite player of all time was Magic Johnson. Oh, nice. Yeah. That's great. Yeah, he's a great one. Yeah. All right, cool. Well, and, uh, tell uh, fight fans where they could uh, keep up with you. Uh, are you on uh, social media? Yeah, my uh, Instagram is uh, Tremaine underscore Midget. My Twitter is Tremaine underscore Midget. You can find me on Facebook at Tremaine Williams. And just send me a message or... Or, or at me or follow me whatever just, just hit me up all right sounds great and my uh, magic may we sign you off all right cool and we will uh, see you uh, good luck next uh, saturday night may 30th in danbury thank you man